the latest mode in frescoes, Boyana Church. This is the portrait of Sebastocrato Caloyan, a medieval aristocrat who commissioned the construction of this church for his family. It was built in a suburb of Sofia, the capital city of Bulgaria. The original church was built during the 11th century. Kaloyan built a new chapel adjacent to the old one and covered the entire inner walls with fresco paintings. These splendid fresco paintings depict 89 scenes which feature 240 characters in total. These are portraits of the Kaloyans. Kaloyan's wife, Desislava, stands next to him wearing a crown which hides her hair. This was the fashion in Europe in those days. Kaloyan himself is wearing a stylish outfit. This grapevine pattern, which was very popular in ancient Greece, was making a revival in the fashion world at that time. These painted portraits are the oldest ones to be found in Bulgaria today. This is the portrait of Kaloyan's cousin and then Emperor Constantin T. Asen and his wife Irina. The Emperor wears red jewels and clothes adorned with golden accessories. Red was the symbolic colour of the Emperor and was forbidden to be worn by common people. Even his shoes are bright red. Among all the paintings, the figure that was most frequently portrayed here is Saint Nicholas, the patron saint of the Kaloyan family. In this painting, the tormented faces of seamen are vividly portrayed. The painting style adopted here reflected a very new concept, which went against the then mainstream Byzantine style, known for its more formulated and less expressional style. This one portrays a renowned biblical scene of the Last Supper, but some unusual items are found on the table. These are leeks and garlic, very popular foods in Bulgaria. A method of new, free and unique expression can be seen in the Boyana church paintings. They show that the spirit of Renaissance was already blossoming in this eastern part of Europe long before the Italian Renaissance movement actually began.